just really quickly before we get inside the 13th annual Untapped Blues Festival, there's wineries, there's a beer garden, gourmet food, and it's always a bad sign when you see one of those parked in the driveway. This is going to be a fun time. Which, I need to make it look as big as possible because... Sample size. That's That smoke means delicious. Right, this is the bacon wrapped hot dogs. What made you think of doing a bacon wrapped hot dog? That's insane. Um, I just did my research and uh, played my cards right. You know what, hot dog's delicious, bacon's delicious, you put them both together. <laughs> So the MCZA <laughs> Mid Columbia what? Zymergy Association. What does the Zymergy stand for? Zymergy is pretty much home brewing. Essentially, it's fermentation. All right, that's what you're doing here. Yeah, you brew your own. Here, right over here, yeah. Oh, you're making it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're making a barley wine right there. Oh my, goodness. it's not gonna be ready today though. No, oh. it'll be sell for sale next year. It takes about probably a month for it to even be drinkable with the barley wine, but we're gonna age it for about a year. Oh my goodness, that's gonna be some good. Pop some champagne bottles, bring it out next year, sell the bottles. And... So it, this place next year, yep. so the 14th annual Untapped Blues Festival. The annual right here will be selling yeah, that no beer. Problem. So that beer right there will be for sale next year. Yes. Kind of the process going on. This is Lulu and Company. Okay, and, and you you have the craziest hats I think I've ever seen. I like I like that guy there. I, do I like that pink number back bottles. here. You do all the Rhythm and Blues festivals. Well, where, where can we find you next? Uh, next will be uh, Sunbanks up at Electric City. Oh my goodness. And we love chemos. And now what is that? It's a hop infusion. It's a hop infusion. You actually see them right there. That's that and that. And ice. Is it is it tappable? Huh? Is it tappable? Yeah. That's what this beer runs through. Yeah, right now. Oh my goodness. It's hop. It's extra hop. It's hop infused. It's like uh, it's like adamantium in the in the Wolverine claws there. Oh my god. Just wanted to point out that rude isn't spelled properly. It That's why. Your last name is Rude. Yeah. Oh, see. <laughs> now you gotta have something called the Rude Awakening. I'm gonna try the Rude Awakening at least here while I'm here. One of the above. All right, cool. Hey, how are you feeling? You doing all right? Where are my beer drinkers at? And what's legal for Washington? Point oh eight is legal, but if you're acting intoxicated and you pull a point oh six, they can still get you. I learned that today from the cops. Oh. I got my two dollars. We're gonna try it here. This is, and I'll, and I'll be honest with you too. I had a, I had a couple of drinks. So no. <laughs> I'm at the Untapped Blues Festival. How can I not have a, at least a little bit? You know. Atomic City Roller Girls, and what's your name? Dirty Rotten Stone. All right. How did that happen? I twisted my knee at practice the other day. Oh, so it wasn't like some injury or anything? Nobody uh, no. did a Tanya Harding to you then? No, it wasn't a Tanya Harding thing. I did it. I just twisted it. It'll be fine. Okay, so what do you do with the Atomic City Roller Girls? I skate. And you beat people up along the way, or uh, how does that uh, work out? Legally. Legally in beat the, in, Within the... The boundaries of the <laughs> Okay. Yes. Um, and it would not be a fun fair without kettle corn. And we're happy you're here. You're with Ron's, obviously. And you just make it the old fashioned way, right? Yep. With a nice big old kettle. With a big old kettle. <laughs> When this started, everybody just stopped what they were doing to watch this guy play. It's insane. 